In this video I'm gonna show you exactly how to build this handyman website. It's a nice modern looking handyman website uh, with a nice navigation bar. With like you can have things here what you what kind of uh, work you offer and nice images and this theme is actually really customizable and easy to use. So you will have no prom problem building this website and it only takes a few minutes to make. And uh, yeah, so if you like the look of this website, keep watching the video and I will show you step by step how to build it. Okay, so there are two things you need in able to do this website. The first thing is hosting. For this I recommend hosting here because they're cheap and reliable. The cheapest hosting plan costs 2 bucks per month and that's would be that's that will be enough for most of you guys. It's for one web 10,000 uh, visits per monthly. But uh, if you expect more or want to create several websites, you can go with the uh, premium version. And you can have up to 25,000 visitors per month and you can, and you will also get a free domain that costs about 10 bucks. So that's what you need for hosting. And you also need a theme called Avada. This theme costs $69, but it's only a one-time fee. So once you bought it, you will have it for forever and uh, you will all also get all the updates for free. Okay, so once you have bought Hostinger, you want to log into your account and you want to click on hosting up here and you want to click on add website and you want to create a new website and you want to create a WordPress website and you want to create an account and continue and once you have done that, I will show you exactly how to set up the entire website. Okay, so once you're done setting up your website, you want to go back to Hostinger and you want to click on websites up here and you want to edit your website. And you will get to this page and the first thing you want to do is go into appearance here hover on appearance click on theme and here you want to click add new and you want to upload theme but first you need to download the winrar file from Envato Market or ThemeForum and you want to go up to your account here and you want to click on downloads and you will get to this page and you want to click on this and click on instead click on this one ball WordPress file only and you also want to download this text file right here and once you have done that you want to go back to your website and you want to upload the file open install I can do it install it's gonna unpack the theme once you have done that you wanna you're gonna see this icon up here Avada and you want to go to the dashboard and you want to scroll down to see this this is the text file you downloaded so this file you got here the text file you want to open that and you will get a code and you want to paste that code right here and click register. Okay, so now all we need to do is build the actual website. So let's go here to the Avada dashboard and click on websites and scroll down a little bit. And uh, it shows it's here for me. Or the website is called Handyman. So you can also search for it here if it doesn't show up and click on import and import all content. Click import and OK and we are gonna let it load and go ahead and click done and actually the first thing we're gonna do is actually scroll down to uh, appearance right here and you wanna click on customize so and let's start by changing the site identity so change so the first thing you wanna do is change to your company name here or company and a tagline maybe like we do the job or just do it for example and also you want to you don't have to do this but it's this little icon, you see the hammer up here and uh, you should make it in 512 by 512 uh, You can easily make an icon on like Canva I can leave the link below to Canva if you want this little icon else it will just be like this uh, globe up here but uh, yeah, it's up to you if you want it or not and uh, you wanna click publish after that so this saves and after that we wanna go back to the dashboard right here and we wanna scroll down or actually we want to go to the Avada dashboard and you want to click on live builder right here and here you can see the website how this is your website right now how it looks and it's really easy to edit the website for example if you would like to change the logo you click here edit header and you just change the image I can actually show you edit header and you see here this comes over and you want to click this little uh, pen and you want to scroll to this background section right here and you want to go to image here actually you do not want to do that what's wrong you want to select this one and here you can see the logo and you just remove it and you go ahead and upload your own logo you can also upload any image you want here I'm just gonna show you so let's take this for now and then 
be changed and you want to click save and now that's the new logo for the website and let's go back here to the main page so and i'm gonna show you a little bit how you can edit on this in the live builder but the website is finished now it's like only up to you to customize it how you like it so if i want to change the text i uh, hover over it and click on it and just type in the text you want and if you would like to change this image exactly how we did with the logo is and you change the image and if you would like to change this free here it's the post type on proof portfolio and if we go back to wordpress click on this x up here exit to dashboard just leave and you want to go to posts i believe or it's all pages probably portfolio portfolio oh it's actually here portfolio and here is where you edit this for example this is the maintenance one one of the free images and you can just edit all here you can remove by just doing that save now it's removed so that's how you change those let's go back to the main page again live builder that's how you edit them and if you would like to change this image it show up directly remove you can also remove entire sections like this see it's disappeared you can also remove this yeah so that's how you do it and this is on the blog side you see like i showed you earlier also if they contact you here you will get an email this will be sent to the email you created wordpress with site with but let's go back just leave and you said you saw that the website had uh, posts so you changed them here the post floating shelf staining and you, if you want to edit them like we did on the front page you click on live builder like this here you can go ahead and change them yeah but it's very easy but it takes a few hours to getting into but after that you like you know how to do everything and good luck with your website thank you for watching